Uh, Fidelio DKD is a large trial looking at a non-steroidal mineralocorticoid receptor antagonist or MRA uh, that is called finernone compared against placebo in 5,734 patients with type 2 diabetes and CKD with EGFR between 25 and 75. The primary endpoint of this trial was a kidney failure outcome and that was met 18% relative risk reduction uh, with a p-value of 0 0.0014. The key secondary endpoint was a cardiovascular outcome, and that key, point, key endpoint was also met with a p-value of 0 0.038 and a relative risk reduction of 14%. So what if in effect it shows that on top of ACE and ARP therapy, which was optimized over a four to 16 week period, this drug can potentially reduce kidney failure outcome and cardiovascular outcome in people with both diabetic uh, diabetes, type two diabetes and chronic kidney disease. Uh, Phenernone is a non steroidal MRA uh, which means that it doesn't have the steroidal structure that other existing molecules have, for example, spironolactone or plernone. Uh, this drug works differently at the genomic level and transcribes a number of molecules that have anti-inflammatory and anti-fibrotic properties. And it's believed, at least from animal models, that this is how this drug has salutary effects on both the heart and the kidney. The SGLT2 inhibitors that uh, have been tried so far have been amazing discoveries. They have changed the way uh, people with kidney disease and heart failure are treated. Uh, we have found these drugs after waiting for nearly two decades of using uh, inhibitors of uh, renin angiotensin system. Uh, but now we have a new therapy, which is uh, phenernone. Uh, this is again an investigational drug so far, it's not been approved yet, uh, but it can potentially reduce kidney failure outcomes and heart, fail and heart uh, disease outcomes in people with type two diabetes and chronic kidney disease. Uh, more important, Fidelio is just the beginning. The EGFR range in this trial was between 25 and 75. The median EGFR was 44. More than half the patients in this trial have EGFR of, of less than 45. And nearly 90% of the people have macroalbuminuria. The sister trial called the FIGURO has a mean EGFR of 68. That means more than half the people will have uh, stage two kidney disease or better. And uh, nearly half the people have microalbuminuria. So next year, we hope to announce the results of the Figaro DKD trial, and that would broaden the implications of, of this investigational drug to a broader range of uh, patients with kidney disease who might derive benefit uh, from the use of this drug on top of uh, RAS inhibition. <laughs> 